Okay, okay, okay. I want to get this one made here. Uh, just sitting there, you know, uh, kind of dreaming there, uh, but uh, thinking about some things. Let's think about, think about selfishness and myself, you know, and how I've dealt with it and uh, and other people's selfishness. How I've, I've dealt with other people's selfishness and, in my life and, and how I'm, I've really come a lot on the way in, in, in that topic recently. Uh, but that's the story I want to share. So, um, it's a hard one to admit. You're, you're, you've been selfish in your life. It's really hard to admit you when you've been super selfish in your life, you know. But um, we're not talking. I'm not really talking about everyone admitting anything to anybody else right now. I'm talking about admitting things to yourself. And um, that's bigger than anything. You know, that's really the biggest thing ever. So, um Oh, God. So, uh, selfishness. Now, uh, first thing is, people think, uh, you know, when I talk about selfishness, I'm talking about a bad thing. I'm not talking about a bad thing at all. Selfishness is not a bad thing at all. Here's why. Um, you have to be selfish. You have to be selfish to live, to survive, right? Okay, it's uh, it's built in. It's just like, an a think of animals. We're animals too, okay? But, but think of wild animals, because wild animals haven't been domesticated and haven't had all the luxuries of, of and advantages of, of, of all the, you know, whatever. The bells and whistles of life that come from being a human being that, you know, kind of dissolve a lot, away a lot of the things that you really need animal instincts for. Um, but so when you're an animal, you know, you're ultimately very, very selfish because you, uh, you've got to survive in the wild. Okay, so about the only time, uh, even though animals can be, you know, cooperative and, and, and can be friendly to one another, very, very much so, you know, and, and some animals can be very, very loving to each other uh, as, you know, uh, as a pack or as a, you know, a herd or as a flock or whatever. Um, but, um, yeah, birds can show emotion to each other, believe it or not. But uh, you just got to see it. Uh, so anyway, um, what's my point? The, oh, oh, yeah. Uh, that, you know, a lot of unselfish behavior in the wild um, between animals, okay? But um, but ultimately, animals, when uh, when it comes right down to it, you know, matter of life, life or death, or even even something, you know, like there's something is very, could be very scarce, uh, like food or shelter, or, you know, uh, safety or, or a mate or, you know, things like that. Um, they're you're going to be selfish. Uh, their animals will be ultimately selfish in that in that area and sometimes very viciously selfish okay um except for with one exception and that that one exception here is uh when it comes to uh their family members okay when it comes to uh protecting family and uh you know protecting your young especially uh you know in the wild an animal will protect its young uh, absolutely to the death and viciously and, and protect their life over their own. And uh, that exists in the wild and it also exists in human beings. So, uh, if, you know, if you're a father out there, uh, you know, like me, um, you wouldn't, you would know that too. So if you're uh, or a mother, you know, whatever, you, you would uh, fight for the death for, for your young. And I, I know, no, you would. Okay. So, uh, and, and it's just because it's built in. That's built into your system, and you, you just can't deny it, and you just can't fight it, okay? You might, hey, you might want to save yourself first, but you won't because your, your mind don't work that way. That's Mother Nature meant to be that way. It's built there, okay? So anyway, that's the whole thing. But now I'm talking about, like, the selective selfishness when you want to be selfish, uh, just to be selfish, you know? You, you can turn on and off selfishness. For fuck's sake, you know, I, I can be selfish all day long if I want to be. And I can be unselfish all day long if I want to be. Really, I, I can. I got those. I got that luxury to do it either way. And I can do it in between, too. Um, but I, I think the main thing is is the admitting to yourself how selfish you are and how selfish you've been in your whole life. And, and, and once you realize that and then you, you decide you've got to change it, you know, like I did. I just had to change it. No, no other way. I couldn't not change it at that point. You know, I was gonna die because I was being so selfish. I was so selfish. I was using and using and using, and and to the point of uh, near death every single day. And 
every single day, that near death got closer and closer and closer and it was gonna be there anytime now. So I had to quit uh, drinking and drugging completely and completely because that I was gonna get late. Well, luckily I did it, okay? And But that was very, very selfish behavior to be doing that before. And um, it was unselfish behavior to uh, to stop. Why? Because because my drinking um, affects other people, and so that's where it's selfish to drink. It's unselfish to to, to, to the extent that I and the damage that I was doing to myself and others. Um, so an unselfish thing. But you know what? Also, the unselfish thing of stopping drinking for me was also the most selfish thing that I ever did selfish thing that I ever did was stop drinking and drugs and 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 decide that I didn't want to be so selfish anymore that I wanted to be unselfish I wanted to be kind to others more I wanted to to think about others not more but just for fucking for the first time really really think of others to the point that I think of them and know them and understand them and see them and 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 hope good things for him and all those kinds of things. So, and then when I found out that that's what I was able to do, oh my gosh, I just found out my world just opened up and became one million percent better. Um, just because I was willing to do that. And that's why that was the most selfish thing that I've ever done in my life. The most selfish thing I ever did in my life, in my life was make, made sure that I, I could understand how to not be so selfish. And then to do that, and then that returned to me something very that very that I that I get that's very very valuable now. So that's my point there. Okay, and I hope that made sense. It is uh, Captain's Law. Let's see, uh, one forty one forty five a.m. on uh, uh, whatever January. I don't even know right now. Eleven, twelve, something like that. Twenty twenty two. I knew that one. Okay. Bye, folks. Play it safe out there.